another video response to Hey Gibson. And this one I've already done a response to, but I just recently kind of overhauled all of my videos, so I'm going to make another response. Um, and this is to her video on her element, and that in itself was a video response to Sage Girl, and I think that was a video response to somebody else, so it's a long chain, but I'm going to make this a video response to Olivia. Um, my element, I am also an earth sign, like Olivia. Um, I'm a Virgo. And so even before I knew about astrological signs and things like that, I was always very connected with the earth. And I know everybody says that, and it sounds kind of cheesy, but when I was a little kid, I seriously, I spent all of my time outside. I, I was never inside. And I always loved going barefoot so that I could feel the dirt and the grass underneath my feet. It just felt so natural and amazing. And I loved, loved, loved being in the woods because I could sense the energies of the trees. I could talk to the trees and it was incredible. And the fairies and everything like that was just like, it was a part of me. So growing up and finding out that I was an earth sign, it was kind of like, oh my God, everything makes sense now. Um, and I'm very much an earth sign. Um, I don't seem like I am when you first meet me because when you first meet me, I feel, I seem very, you know, airy, fairy type of and very absent-minded and things like that. But inside of me, I am extremely logical. I'm very down to earth and I don't take nonsense and I'm not very malleable. I kind of stay in the same mode of being for a very, very long time. And I'm extremely stubborn, and that's exactly what an earth sign is. But I'm also very mothering, I'm very understanding, and I defend the people that I love, and I'm extremely loyal, and those are also the traits of, an, of the earth. And again, I've, I've always connected with earth deities. My patron god and goddess is Pan and Persephone. And Pan is, of course, like the quintessential definition of the Earth. And Persephone is the daughter of Gaia, and Gaia is the goddess of, you know, the plants and the crops and the fields and things of that nature. And so them being my Earth signs, it kind of, it makes sense, I guess you could say. Um, and I, so I feel very extremely connected to the Earth. I still love going outside and being barefoot. And I just, in the summertime, I just lay in the grass like this. I'm just like, ah! I love it so much. And I just close my eyes and just feel the energy around me and the energy of the earth. I can literally feel it as a pulsing sensation of the earth. And it's absolutely incredible. And I'm so just grateful that I have such connection to the earth that the earth is my mother and my goddess. And so, yeah, and I still feel very connected to trees. I'm not as close to them as I used to be, which makes me very, very sad, but I want to change that because I've been around a lot of trees in the past couple of years, and so I can feel them trying to communicate with me. And I'm just, my mind hasn't been very open to the experience, but I want to change that now. And the other element that I feel connected to the most is water. Also, like Olivia, it's kind of strange. When I first saw her video, I was like, oh my god, we feel connected to the same element. It's so crazy. So water. Um, I'm a very, very good swimmer, and I feel very at home in the water. Um, there are a few health problems that I have that make it impossible for me to be in the water a lot. But every chance I get, I do go in the water. And I absolutely love it. Because I feel like water and earth are like sister elements. They can't function without each other. Um, and so when I go in the water, I just feel this incredible energy. It's just like I can feel the fish. I can feel the algae and the seaweed and just the movements and the currents. 
current of the water. And it's incredible to me. I could stay in there all day just swimming around and floating and just, you know. And I'm, a, I'm an extremely emotional person and a very flamboyant person. And water has always been associated with moodiness and changing personalities and emotions and things of that nature. And so I feel like if I was an element, I would probably be water because that's what I come across at, um, to most people, which I'm okay with. And so I find it interesting that earth and water are both signs of the goddess and representations of her. And so I'm very connected to those two because they are so feminine. They represent the two sides and personalities of the feminine aspect of the divine. And so, yeah. And I also feel very connected to Earth, but purely from one, an intellectual point of view, because Earth has always been connected to the intellectual and rationality and thinking and things like that. And it's also connected to dreams and imagination and flights of fancy. And in case you guys haven't noticed, I would very, very much like that. I daydream pretty much all of the time, which sounds so bad, but I love it. And I have a very extremely overactive imagination. And so I'm very influenced by air. And of course, I'm extremely connected to fairies and things like that, and they are partially of the element of air. So yeah, I'm not so much connected with fire. The only thing I'm really connected to fire is because I have an extremely short temper, and yeah, it's really bad, but I want to work more with fire because I think fire is absolutely beautiful, and I feel such a connection to the other elements that I want to make a connection with fire. So yeah, that's my element. My element is earth. Um, I'm very, very earthy. I love to touch things, and I love to see things. I, my sense that dominates me is seeing things. Like, that's just, that's how I connect to things. Um, so yeah, I think that's it. I hope this wasn't too, like, oh, confusing. I hope I didn't blabble too much, but I really wanted to make a video to sponsor this video because I thought it was awesome. Awesome. Okay, that was really weird, but yeah. Um, so make a video response to either this video or Olivia's video. That'd be really, really awesome. I want to know about what element you guys connect the most with and which one you love the most and etc. So yeah, I'll see you guys later. Blessed be.